Hey, what's up everybody? So, my name's Russ. I am with rwgresearch.com and this is a three weeks to go Pulse Motor Build-Off pre-Xmas, okay? The uh, IAEC forums and the RW Research and also open-source-energy.org um, websites all in the forums all come together and we're hosting this awesome uh, Pulse Motor Build-Off and um, I don't really have anything to show you right now. I've got just a few pictures. People uh, may be wondering whether or not I'm building one. Of course I am. It's just for fun, but uh, it really gets your brain going. Really think outside the box here. It's, I, I, I really enjoy that. Um, it's always good to take a break from what you're doing, have a little fun, learn, learn a little something, and then apply that back to what you were doing originally, which is what I've been doing. And it, actually, it's been a very good thing. Um, so, I'm not going to really talk to you a whole bunch. I just want to post a couple of other videos of other people that have been working on their pulse motor. And um, I would like you guys to do something. If you want, um, make a quick little clip of uh, why you think this pulse motor build-off is important and uh, share, your, uh, share your thoughts. After you see this video, um, you'll see a couple other people talking about what their thoughts are on about it. And I didn't ask these people to do that. They just did it. And I'm going to use their clips and put them on here and let you guys see them. Um, so find, uh, if you want, make a little video and uh, send me the link. And uh, I'll use it in my next update video for the pre-Xmas Pulse. I'm going to build off 2012. Um, for those of you who um, think that uh, the rules are kind of... Uh, interesting this round they really are and um, really it's not complicated you just really have to think outside the box um, when I first got Tin Man's information on what he wanted to do and the rules I was like oh man that's gonna take people it's gonna take people a month just to figure out how to get to, to, to get the energy to the run capacitor I'm like oh gee whiz but uh, just really just think outside the box what I'm doing is pretty unique um, if someone else has the same idea as me, I'll be very surprised, but you never know. You, never, you really never know. So anyway, enjoy these few clips. Uh, send me a link of your information if you'd like, if you want to tell me a little bit about uh, why you think it's important. Make a quick little video, and we'll throw it up on the web. Uh, if you want, go post a link over also at the, uh, uh, the forums. I will put both of the links in this description. So enjoy. Uh, Rust, your host, and Ten Man, which is over in Australia. Somewhere that way, uh, down down under somewhere. Anyway, so I uh, really appreciate all the uh, the uh, interesting things that's been going on with uh, Mark Danzi and Smart Scarecrow and Zero Fossil Fuel. Um, we still need a third judge. Uh, Mark says he's going to donate some prizes um, and his group. So it's just it's just a great thing. I really love it. And uh, hopefully, well, I know this will be an annual event, but hopefully next time we'll try to plan it out to where you guys get a little bit more leadway on when it's going to happen, and then we'll go for it. All right, peace and love to you all. Enjoy your day. Leave a comment. Love ya. Bye. Hi, everyone. This is Jet from uh, IAEC Forum, and this is my introduction for the Pulse Motor Build-Off. This is my introduction for the uh, Pulse Motor Build-Off. I wish everyone good luck with it. Uh, I'm uh, Jet from uh, IEC forum and uh, let's have fun doing it guys and we'll see you guys on the web and bye for now G'day guys, Cordy here with another video for you all. Alright, so the AEIC and RWG Research are running another Pulse motor build off. And King Man would like us to post a video on what direction we're going to go in. Well, Tin Man I have no bloody idea mate. I'm gonna let this one control me whatever direction we're going over voltage standoffs we can get creative um it's just where this build's going to take me i don't know so to all my competitors out there who are going to be joining in the pulse motor build off good luck to you all i hope you all do really well um first price is mine uh this is all about enjoyment um and more to the point, I think, a lot of, even like Tin Man and that, they've all hit on enjoyment, and this is all just a bit of fun. One thing I think this competition brings is a camaraderie. It brings us all together, where we can all be in the one area of uh, 
experimentation for a little while and we can all share ideas and take them away uh, if you're anything like me you're taking ideas from one project to the next all the time so this is just a good way to get us all together all in one place where we can all have a bit of fun so go have some fun guys enjoy the pulse motor build off and i will see you in the prize collection hall so come and join us on either iaec.forumco.com or rwgresearch.com and come and get yourselves a prize. But actually, I first want to do a plug. I want to start off and then get into a rant later about the, all the bad things. But you uh, plugged a competition. It's a pulse motor build-off competition. Some of the home experimenters and other people and uh, for some reason, uh, myself and a friend called Zero uh, are going to be judges on this. I think they want me to see if, what colours it comes in and judge on those criteria. But why these little events are important, often these people, what I, I've got a technology I'm evaluating tomorrow, and unfortunately this guy thinks he's worked in isolation for many years. He thinks he's got something that will conserve energy and all the rest and it's going to be more than likely that another hundred people and I've already done it and this guy would have known about that if he connected a network and these little competitions and these little forums and groups of enthusiasts to build pulse motors or investigate magnetic motors or whatever they're doing it's important they share ideas because quite often what somebody does inspires another and I really am 100% behind these people and I think they're doing a wonderful job. And it's important they don't work in isolation, they trigger each other off and collectively sometimes they do make a breakthrough. So I just want to give that a little plug because I think it's great and there Is should there be more right? of it. And there's some people doing some good work. So that's one tier, the people who do this for their passion, they want to make a change, sometimes they want to make a lot of money, but they're normally doing it because they're enthusiastic and a lot of good stuff comes from that. So I fully support it.